Hello friends, welcome to governmentjobspreparation.com. Today I am going to teach you profit and loss. Let's see the question. Our first question is, a shopkeeper professes to sell his goods at cost price. He uses 900 gram weight for 1 kg. Find his gain proceed. Right. 1 kg is equal to 1000 gram. And in place of 1000 gram, he is giving only 900 grams. So his profit is 100 gram, right? 100 gram on 900. He is taking money from the customer for 100 gram, but how much he is giving? Is giving only 900 grams, it means he has he is in profit of 100 grams. Of 900, he is getting profit of 100 grams, and we always when we have to get the gain percent, we always calculate it on 100. Right? Cancel this. What we get? 100 by 9. And we know the value of 100 by 9 is 9, 11, 1 by 9 or 9.09 percent. This is the profit which he gets after doing this, right? Our next question is, by using false weight, a shopkeeper sold sugar at cost price, but he uses 700 gram weight in place of 1000 gram, find the percent PMA. Again, the same portion on 1000 gram, he is getting, he is giving only 750 grams, so he is in profit of 250 grams. Right. On 750 grams, he is getting profit of 250. And when we have to get the percent PNL, what is the value? The value is 100 by 3. That is 33. 1 by 3 portion or 33.33 portion. This is in profit of 33, 1 by 3 portion. Right. Our next question is these two portions are very important. Third portion is also very important. A man sells a table at the piece. 18,700 at loss of 15 percent. If he wants to gain of 15 percent at what price he must sell it? A person who is selling his table, he is selling his table at 15 percent loss. So, you think why 15 percent like this? When we divide it by 5, we get 3 by 20. It means First of all, he gets loss of 15 percent. 15 percent means out of 20, he is getting his CP was 20, but the selling price was 17 only. He purchased that table with rupees 20, and he sold that table. With loss of 15 percent, it means for the 17 only. Right. So the value of CP is 17, but what we are given, we are given this 18700. And 18700 is 1100 times of 17. So now multiply this 20 with 1100. That is. 23,000. Right. Right. 
It means he's, he purchased that table with rupees 22,000 and he sold that table with rupees 18700 at loss of 15%. But now he wants to gain with the same 15%. The gain of 15% would be we get this 17 from minus, we minus 3 from 20, but now he is looking for gain. He's looking for the gain with the same 15 person. Now what is the gain? 20. Now add this 3 in 20, that would be that will become 23. Fine. What is his cost price? This was the cost price. That was twenty two thousand. Twenty two thousand is eleven hundred times of twenty. Right? Twenty two thousand is eleven hundred times of twenty. So now multiply eleven hundred with twenty three. What we get? We get three five two. Zero, zero. It means if he sells his table with rupees 25,300, he can get the gain of 15%. So this is an answer which we have taken from. So it was the first type of profit and loss. I'll be teaching you other types of profit and loss in my next video. By the time, keep watching and learning. Thank you so much.